Hello guys from Insomnium, I'm Carla from Antichrist Metal Zion. How are you guys? Very fine, thank you. <laughs> Just around to really wintry Romania. It looks like Finland. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> and it's been a very good tour. And everything is done very well. Looking forward to the show tonight. So yeah, actually one week ago you embarked on this tour along Tribulation, so how was it so far? Surprisingly good. Like there's some places where we have never played before, like Lithuania. That was like great. <laughs> First time in Lithuania and sold out so. And basically great. we didn't know anything what to expect, but it's been really, really good. And we heard like today's pre-sales are like 600 and we've never played in Bucharest before, so yeah, pretty good. We're positively surprised. We didn't know what to expect really before the tour, but it's been really, really good tour so far. Yeah. So you are still promoting your latest album, Winter's Gate. So how is the public still re responding to the songs? Or well, I think it works works nicely live. We play the whole 40 minutes of Winter's Gate, and then some older stuff is not nicely. The set is kind of split it in two. First Winter's Gate, the audience reacts a bit differently and then when we start the older songs everybody kind of wakes up and yeah. starts partying. It's, it's nice to follow, it happens every night about the same. So you actually, you aren't playing on this tour the entire album as you did before? You are playing also old songs? Yeah, we are playing the long, yeah, long set. But like starting with Winter Skate and I really like to play it first because it's something completely different and it's like Nilo said, people are first listening to it and concentrating more and also we are kind of yeah kind of different mood but on the end of the set where we play the classics or anti classics. <laughs> yeah, it's more of a party party rock and roll show in the <laughs> end and when we just get it's a different atmosphere. So yeah. Yeah. But tell me a bit about the concept behind this album. Well, the, the lyrics are based on a short story that I wrote already like 10 years ago. And uh, when we first had this idea that we want to try to make a really long song, I remember this story then thought that we're going to need something bigger for the lyrics as well. And it would probably suit this. The other guy said, OK, let's do it like this. And that's how it, it got started. Piece by piece. Yeah. yeah. But it took so like two years at least to get the whole idea moving because yeah. we already started to speak up the long song when we were rehearsing Shadows of the Dying Sun album so kind of buried that idea for a few years and then it was ready. Yeah. And when do we expect a new album from you? Good question. <laughs> <laughs> but maybe next year if everything goes well so let's see how fast we can produce new stuff. We've been touring so a lot with Winter Skate, so we're kind of banned that it's not able to write music during the tour, so we need some time in the home cave yes. to make it happen, but we started now to do some new songs, and so the wall is rolling. Yeah. Your USA dates are already confirmed, do you have other touring plans, summer festivals, maybe South America tour? Only a couple of summer festivals. Uh, we don't want to do actually more this summer. Last year, summer was so busy. And then basically, we take some time off and do the new songs, hopefully. So, kind of a take a break after the summer from touring. Well, I'm waiting to hear a new album too. <laughs> <laughs> Someday, somehow. Yeah. Well, you are coming from Finland and the metal scene there is very huge to say so. So how do you see the metal scene today comparing to the past, let's say, when you started as a band? There's been few, if we speak only from Finland, few different times in Finland when we started kind of in the 90s doing metal. Metal wasn't really That's successful big, yeah. in Finland. And then immediately like, 2005 metal was like the 
national music of Finland and it was a trend music and everyone was listening to metal and all the festivals had like a lot of metal bands and now it's getting again a little bit more into the underground so yeah yeah trends come and go that's true <laughs> mm. trends but come, on, come and go but yeah manovar is forever <laughs> <laughs> in yeah. good and bad but do you see differences uh, between the public also in different countries to yourself yeah, of course crowds are different like and in eastern europe in general i think the audience are very good they're very enthusiastic they like to get crazy it doesn't matter if it's monday or tuesday uh, like in yeah. finland, <laughs> finland there's no point playing on monday but here it doesn't matter people get crazy anyway and it's very nice to play here well, sometimes when bands are confirmed here and they see, you know, during the week, everyone, why the bands weren't confirmed <laughs> on the weekend? But that's how it should schedule them. People are like, okay, I go or not. <laughs> but still. Yeah, it's the booking agents who run yeah. the business, yeah. not the bands. We are just slaves of the machinery. Exactly. <laughs> but if you're touring, you have to play somewhere on Monday and Tuesday as well. You can't play only. Friday and Saturday. Of course, yeah. that's how we this book then. Yeah. And being a musician on tour, the most common question is what day is today? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> we don't know. I didn't know what yeah, day you was forget. yesterday. <laughs> yeah, it doesn't really matter when you're touring. But it's Saturday. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> All day. Yeah. What do you consider to be the main things Insomnium have achieved all these years? Well, that we are still active after 20 years. We have to be but we are very fortunate and lucky that we managed to stay, stay together and make seven albums and reach this point that we are still touring actively. It's good to remember that many, many bands don't ever get this far or, or last 20 years. I have to be proud of that. The car carrier highlight, the hot sauce <laughs> under the name of our band. <laughs> oh, yeah. that's, the, that's the best thing ever. Well, I can't wait to see you performing. It will be my first time seeing you and... Thanks for the interview. She's from Antichrist Metal Dine. Thank you. Thank you, Antichrist. <laughs>